Well, some high profile cases will be back in the courtroom today and one involves Jamie Knoll facing more than a decade in prison for crimes while he served as sheriff of Clark County. Today's appearance is a sentencing hearing. It comes more than a year after Indiana State Police first opened an investigation to address allegations of criminal activity while Knoll was in office from 2015 to 2022. Wave News reporter Kirsten Foote is outside of the Clark County Courthouse this morning. That's where that hearing will take place. Kirsten? Good morning, Shannon. The Wave troubleshooters have been following this case every step of the way. Now, just as a refresher, back in August, Jamie Knoll pleaded guilty to 27 of the 31 felonies he's charged with, and that brings us to today's sentencing hearing. Now, this entire case revolved around his time as head of New Chapel EMS and as sheriff. Some of those charges include tax evasion, ghost employment, and corrupt business practices. Under the plea agreement, Knoll would be sentenced to 12 years in prison and three years probation. Special Judge Larry Medlock has said he wants to hear from other victims to help him determine if that 12-year prison sentence is the right fit. Special Prosecutor Rick Hurdle believes it's near the maximum he could get under the law. Hurdle, what are you doing? He didn't ple he pled guilty to all these. Why can't you just stack, stack, and stack? Well, there's provisions within the state of Indiana that does not allow for things to be consecutive to one another, but allows for what's called concurrent one with the other. The hearing will be open to the public with 100 seats and other courtrooms used as over overflow. Now, just as a reminder, today's sentencing hearing is scheduled for 9 this morning at the Clark County Courthouse. Reporting live, Kirsten Foote, Wave News. Thanks, Kirsten. And Jamie Knoll is not the only Knoll expected to go before a judge today. His wife, Misty, is charged with theft and tax evasion for charging more than $600,000 on New Chapel's credit card and failing to report the spending on her tax returns. Jamie's daughter Casey faces similar charges for charging more than $100,000 on the credit card. But their cases might not go to trial at all. Earlier this month, prosecutors said they were close to reaching a plea deal. But whether or not the judge accepts the deal will probably also depend on today's testimonies at Jamie Knoll's sentencing.